boy oh boy welcome back to the channel this is the episode number four of the speedx model 1631 restoration we're going to try to get as much as we can done today i'm not sure what all we're going to get done but we're on to the painting stage come on i'll show you what we've already got is that a good piece of wood there bubba huh you like that stick Is it good for you? You crazy dog. All right, let me show you what we got. I've been painting a little bit in the evenings, a little bit where I can. We've been painting the frame. There's not a whole lot to that. It's just, you know, just painting, so wasn't a whole lot of content, but we uh, decided to go paint the steering shaft and the um, gear shift shaft black, so I got those taped off. Got the engine wrapped off. Just really just painting. Oh, I decided to go with uh, black for the hubs. Uh, the other Speed X we got, which is over there, the 1631. I went with red and I want to see what black turns out, see how that looks. But yeah, we pretty much got this part done. And we still got these pieces over here to paint. Fenders. I got to straighten out that piece of the bumper there. Belt guard, chain guard, and the hood. This is going to be about the funnest piece. Whew. All right, well, it's getting hot. It's been hot. I don't know if y'all live around Texas. We've been in the hundreds pretty for, consecutive, for some consecutive days now. But anyway, we're not going to make excuses around here. We're just going to make it happen. So let's get to it. All right, now we got these cleaned up and they've dried. They're ready for some paint. We'll do the underside first. And then we'll do the top side last. I might put two coats on this, I'm not sure. For those of you who are wondering, we're using the Sunrise Red Rust-Oleum. It's the same color I always use. All right, we're gonna let that dry up a little bit and we'll flip it over and then we'll do the other side. All right, now, while we're waiting on the fenders and chain guard to dry, we're gonna go ahead and start painting this seat and this uh, chain over here. We're gonna put some white on this. Now, the chain, that is the hood stop. That stops the hood from, wow, that was, that was nice. It's almost like, a, I guess you could make some wind chimes out of that. <laughs> But uh, this is the stop for the hood, and I painted it white on the other one. I liked it. It looked pretty good. Honestly, if you're trying to go factory, it's probably not painted at all. But we're going to paint it white because it's kind of rusty, so, and I like the way it looks. So anyway, here we go. Let's get some color on this.
around there. All right, we're well, gonna let that dry. And we'll flip it over. But let's get back to the fender and chain guard. All right, it's been a little bit. Let's flip this stuff over. that dry for a little bit let's go get to the seat and the chain let's put another coat on that all right now we're ready to put a lay some paint on the belt guard it for a little bit that's just the first coat and then we're gonna work on the bumper all right now for the bumper we're gonna do it like the other one instead of just painting the whole thing red we're gonna do this little part here white just to kind of break it up so anyway let's get started on it looking at that one over there I realized that this part here was white too I did that one on that too so we're gonna do it the same that dry for a little bit we'll put another couple coats and then after this dries and cures we're going to tape this white part off and then we'll paint the rest of it red but it's easier just to take this part off and try to mask off the red so all right well see you in a little bit now we're going to put the first coat of paint on the hood Let's get this done
Well, that was about empty. That's good for one coat. Well, all right, guys. That's going to do it for painting these parts. Uh, still got a few more coats to put on it, but we're going to paint those. And in the next video, we're going to assemble the tractor, get it put back together. But, wow. Yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Trying to make a video here. Didn't need a bunch of noisy bugs. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, cicadas, I don't know what those are. If you know what those are, comment down below. But anyway, like I was saying, next video, after I get all this painted, we're going to reassemble the tractor and get her back going. Uh, my decals came in, so we're going to get those, and hopefully we're going to get this thing wrapped up. But anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. Please like, subscribe, all that mumbo-jumbo. Thank you all for watching, and you all have a good evening.